Hi chums, how are you? After a long time, again I started uh, my videos, so please support. Due to some health issues, uh, I have stopped these many days. So, so many students are asking and uh, parents also asking uh, to support in maths. So that's why I am going to reboot my channel. So I need your support. How we are supporting the support to you is to be continued. Please support and uh, subscribe my channel. So today we are going to learn 10th grade CBSC Mathematics question paper pattern. Before starting that, again welcome to our Maths channel, Maths Mail. So my dear chums, especially it is 10th board examination going students. CBSC board released CBSC question paper pattern. How it is as like as last year. What the pat question paper pattern it is going to be in the sense. So it has five sections. The question paper consists five sections in the use. Especially first section, section A, 20 MCQs are there. Out of the 20, everyone should remember question number 19 and 20, assertion reason type questions. Okay, next coming to section B, it has five questions. Each question carries two marks. So section B consists 10 marks. So hope you are following. Section A 20 months, Section B 10 months. Coming to Section C, it is like short answer question, more than lengthy, sorry, more than short, more than less than lengthy, medium. So, short answer questions, it consists 6 questions, each carries 3 months. So, 6 3 is 18. Section A 20, 20 MCQs. 19 and 20 assertion and reason type questions section b here it is very short answer questions so that is 5 5 to 10 and coming to section c short answer questions six questions it consists 6 3 is 18 hope you got the clarity 5 now coming to section b section b consists long answer questions so like uh, what it is applications of trigonometry this is the long answer questions, how it is like that. So in this also, it consists four questions. Each question carries five months. So four files, 20. Again, 20, 10, 18 and 20. You are getting it is 68 marks. 68 marks up to section B. And they mention, especially to increase the uh, enhancement of the student, knowledge enhancement based questions like the competency based or case based questions so that it can be section E this is very very important how the segregation is some case study that means somewhat case based questions we will get some information based on that we are getting some questions in the each question carries that means 4 marks 3 questions are there 3 4 12 and how the distinct uh, division in the C, case based in the sense so case based questions how it is Three questions, each question consists of three questions. Out of that, two one mark questions and one two mark questions. So coming to the choice, I didn't explain the about the choice. Each and every section except MCQs, it has choice. For example, section B, here we are having five questions like two questions has internal choice. For example, one question is from line uh, linear equations. The second question, the internal choice question is also from linear equation. Like that, two topics has, that means two questions has internal choice. Same line that section C, two questions has internal choice. Same line that section D, two questions has internal choice. Oh, you are understood. Similarly, in the question, the case based question, two more question is internal choice. So, my dear chance, please utilize this video how to prepare for the board examination before writing the question that means before writing the exam we should get to another question paper pattern which is designed by CBSC it is very very important everyone should prepare accordingly and coming to MCQs don't 
delay in the MCQs because MCQs are very very important even two more sums also can comes under MCQs so prepare everything all the best your uh, final board examinations my dear chums hope you all are utilizing this opportunity and thanks for giving me this opportunity to teach you uh, please subscribe my channel maths mill for your more intelligence in the mathematics thank you bye bye